we're currently en route to the airport. I'm with my mom and my sister Lucy. And we've got our little dog Archie as well because he's been a bit worried the last few days with all the cases being around that we thought we'd just bring him along for the trip. And Tyler, Fred, Tyler. all packed and ready to go um we've got like an eight o'clock flight so we've got um quite a while to wait but um yeah we're really excited i don't think it's gonna be i'm gonna be that excited until i'm on the actual airplane but um yeah it still doesn't really feel real it doesn't feel real that i'm going no uh, it's, it's exciting but yeah i think it'll be nice to sort of uh, see you go off and uh, start your adventure um, yeah i'll be taking you with me so i hope you enjoy seeing our little trip to New York at the moment and then our road trip across to Los Angeles. See you in a bit. So we've just arrived at Heathrow. Look who came to say goodbye. Archie. Archie, look. Archie, look. Archie. Can you say goodbye? We've just weighed our cases and how much is mine, Tyler? Um, 22. 22 and yours is? 15. 15. You can tell who's the happy packer. It's dad and mum and little Lou. Hi. So we just got food in. Bridge, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I got, I was really naughty and got a chicken burger, chicken bacon burger with sweet potato chips. And Tyler got, I don't know what you got. You got a chicken pie. <laughs> it was so good. Uh, he was like, what did you say? You wanted something fabulously British. Well, we're going to be in burger first, so. But I had a little birthday barbecue yesterday and I don't think I actually had a burger, so I thought. I'll get one. Push um, the boat out. Push the boat out. And then I brought this from Duty Free. I brought this Elizabeth Arden Visible Difference BB Cream. I put it on my sister yesterday. Remnants of my earlier one. And it was so good that I was like, right, I need to buy a new one. So I picked that up. And that's all we've really bought so far. I think we might go to Jack Wills. And um, it's like 50% off there. And have a little shop. We'll let you know what we get. So we're just in with Jack Wills and Tyler's found two t-shirts that he's already in love with and totally buying. Show them what you got. That one. How much are they? Uh, £11 <laughs> and £15. Yeah, stripey t-shirts for £11 and £15. Not bad. Not bad. So this is our second attempt on the long escalator because we got on before and then Tyler realised we'd forgotten something. So we are back on now. Um, Tyler just spotted some footballer and is really excited about it. Yeah. Who did you spot? John Joe Shelby. <laughs> he was like, oh, it's the footballer that looks like Voldemort. Tyler's currently setting up his phone so it works in America with three. You can get this um, one month only contract. So you just pay like 15 pounds and you can use your phone for free or for no more than your contract costs in America or I think in Europe as well. So that's really good. And Tyler, what are you wearing today? Playing tea, I was meant to be wearing something different but we forgot stuff so we have to go back and I didn't go to the lady I stay with in London's house to get my um, dungarees so I'm wearing this great t-shirt from New Look and these like Kareem pants from um, H&M but I was meant to be wearing my dungarees so it's not a strong look. So we've just took off, Tyler what are you going to watch? What films have caught your eye? Shades of Grey on here, which I think is a really odd film to watch on a plane, don't you? A bit, bit odd. Um, I think I might watch Interstellar and Jupiter Ascending and Inherent Vice. Got a few hours to kill. What's the time? It's 10 p.m. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> We're really tired and look so jet lagged. We're trying to find where we get our hire car from and it's taken so long. It took us like three hours to go through and get go through immigration. I can't even talk. Go through immigration, get our luggage, and then go through another declaration thing and it's taken so long but we're finally out and now we've got to find a car and try to drive our hotel so wish us luck and so we've just oops, listen to this one please stand clear the doors are closing please hold on 
I love American accents. So we're now on a train to get to our rental car, aren't we? Tyler's so tired and bless him, he's got to drive us to our hotel. Poor love. Um, we've got a really kind of what, granny car, haven't we? Actually, we're not too sure, but um, we'll show you what car we've got. So we're just driving into New York now. It's a bit bumpy, but you can see the skyline and it looks incredible. So, so excited. Hi, yes, so we've just arrived at our hotel. We just drove through New York to get to the hotel and it was amazing. I think we're literally just around the corner from the Chrysler building, but I'll show you that tomorrow. It's now, is it 3.30? It's 3.30 in the morning. It took forever at the car place and they were pretty useless. So they ended up upgrading our car. So we've no longer got an old lady car. But um, yeah, this is our room. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, and I will show you everything tomorrow. I think I'm going to go and see a recording of the TV show The View um, because my friend Gabriel works on that and yeah, and show you a bit around New York. It's been a very, very long, long day so I'll be glad to get some rest. I hope you've enjoyed seeing our trip so far.